Once again, a warm welcome to Deji Online. Today, I am going to present some of the useful tips that you can use in Google Meet. Nowadays, the teachers are very concerned about how to share PDF files through Google Meet. There is a useful extension in Google Chrome known as the Cami, and you can add this extension to your Google browser. With the help of that Google browser, you can very easily share, use and communicate with the students using the PDF files. Also, it is very useful to share the corresponding file to the participants of the Google Meet in a very effective manner. I will explain the detailed steps how to include or how to conduct a meeting with the help of a PDF file. It is very easy to add Kami extension to your Google Chrome. If you are installed the extension to your browser, it is very easy. Otherwise, you will have to search for the corresponding extension. Like this in Google. I am typing Kami extension here. Then it will show the Kami extension PDF documentation. You can open it in a new tab. It has already loaded and uh, it is very easy to add the extension. You can press the add to Chrome button, add extension. So it is automatically added to your Chrome browser. You can now see it is opening. It is already added, the Kami extension. PDF is added to your Chrome browser. Then as usual you can proceed to your Google meeting. So after adding Kami to your Chrome browser, you can start a Google meet as a usual. I am joining. Here you can use the presentation menu. Here you select to present now and uh, select a Chrome tab. In the corresponding Chrome tab, you will have to open the Kami first. So I am here selecting a Chrome tab and select a Kami from that. And uh, you are sharing that corresponding Chrome tab. So now it will show different menu items. First of all, you will have to open from a Google Drive. Second one is open from computer. And also you can present a new blank page. You can either select any one of them. I am selecting open from computer. And it will show different folders of your computer. And I am selecting a particular one. So here the corresponding PDF file is opened by the Kami and uh, here you can see a toolbox on the left side of the window. There are various tools are available, drawing tools are available, pen tools are there, brush tools are there and there is text box tools and also you can insert image or anything like that. So I am selecting some of the colors, you can select the different various colors and you can use corresponding changes in your PDF document and it will be automatically shared to the participants. Here, anybody can see the PDF files here, you can scroll. And uh, another important feature is you can add any text here. I am uh, using a text box here and typing sample text. So it will be displayed in all the participants window. Here is another interesting option is there. There is a share document button is here. 
we can use that button first of all it will be uploaded and it will take time for authorization and after uploading after uploading it will show a sharing options window and here you will see a corresponding link and you can copy that corresponding link and uh, if you are going back to your meet screen then you can share that corresponding link to your participant using the chat box here I am pasting and it will be shared to all other participants here the corresponding video file is uploaded by the Kami app and it will be shared using a particular link then all the participants will receive the corresponding link and they can also open that link and open the corresponding document so I am again going back to and log in as a participant it's a participant window and here also the same thing can be seen they can also make some changes erase is using to erase uh, something you can uh, insert the signature also you can insert the something image or any changes can be exchanged between the participant as well as the corresponding meeting holder this is the window of the participant here I am using drawing some shapes I am going back to the other window so anything can be shared anything can be shared between the participant as well as the meeting holder so this is an effective mechanism to share a PDF file through a Google Meet and you can stop the presentation as you require if you like the video you subscribe this channel thank you for watching